Hey YouTube, it's Mike Pan Gangster here, and today we'll do a little video of um, connection issue with uh, FIFA 22. Well, actually, with FIFA games in general. Now, I will give a couple of like tricks that you could do that could help you, but I need you guys to understand something. The people that I'm gonna help are most likely gonna be one out of ten people, and the reason why I'm saying this is because the problem is not you you need to understand one thing okay um in this game okay when it comes to weekend league you're not the problem the problem most likely is on ea side their servers now for people that don't know me or whatever and they're like oh well this guy's just a guy random guy talking as you can see i'm the elite uh, in the elite division i'm in the 1800 skill rating give or take um, I'm able to to qualify for weekend league every week, pretty much going five and zero, super easily. I'm able to get eight to twelve wins, pretty much every week without even struggling. Um, a couple of weeks ago, I showed people that I beat uh, a nine skills. Uh, just to show you guys, I'm able to beat pro players. I'm not a pro player though, but just I'm just trying to give you guys like uh, how do you say like a bit of a view of like of like what I am and who I'm like where I'm coming from when I'm talking like when I'm trying to say like I know what I'm talking about here okay and it's impossible for example a guy that's in the elite division let's say in the 1800 to 1900 skill rating and goes into foot champs and has to stop at eight wins because he can't play no more okay this is what I'm trying to say I it's, it's impossible for me to go into a uh, weekend league with these cool squads that are actually really strong and not able to compete because I can't make a simple pass okay and then I could actually go into a division rival elite division play versus the top players in the world and compete at the same time that if I were going to foot champs wouldn't be able to play it doesn't make sense right there's something happening that there's it just doesn't make sense right and that's most likely because the servers that EA are putting us on are completely shit, okay? Because I've I've went multiple times into Weekend League and the gameplay has been so mudded where I'm talking about like cards like Neymar feel like a bronze player, okay? And then I would go straight after that game into an elite division gameplay and I'm able to do everything. I'm able to play. My players are, are, are moving all correctly. I'm able to pass. I'm able to shoot. I'm able to turn. I'm able to do everything. So what's happening here? Why is it that from one game to another or from two different game modes, because divisions is one thing and foot champs is another thing, why am I lagging so much? Okay? And, and this is why I'm trying to explain to people before I give you guys a few tricks that you could try that could help you. Like I said, it could help that one guy out of ten. You have to understand that most likely the issue is not you and it's EA. So just to make you feel maybe a little bit at ease, a little bit like less mental, <laughs> because I know people are going crazy and they're trying everything. They're changing their internet, they're, they're, they're changing their wires, they think the remote control is broken. They, they, everybody's going crazy. A lot of people don't know what the fuck's happening no more. And eventually you just go nuts right because you're you're doing everything in your hand trying to fix the problem but at the end of the day most likely the problem isn't you okay so hopefully that reassures a few people that guys a lot of people are struggling right now with the uh, gameplay a lot of people i'm telling you myself i stop at eight wins in weekend league because i cannot handle the gameplay i i just can't i can't i cannot go into the gameplay and 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 play and, and have a, a smile on my face i can't it's just it's so horrendous it, it, it's it's un, unplayable basically it's almost unplayable that's how bad it is okay anyways for the few people that i may be able to help you i'll give you guys a few tricks one of the things uh it can only affect a few people for example if you have a ps5 or a ps4 pro or i guess the better version of the xbox or whatever it is because i don't have the xbox so i can't really know about that one when you go into your internet connection okay your setup uh of course if you're if you're like cabled it's always better right than wireless 
But either way, whatever you are, either cabled, like plugged in directly or wireless, when you go to your connection setting uh, and you click your op, you click the option on it, it actually gives you the option to put yourself on the 5G instead of the 2.4 gigahertz, okay? Um, so this could help you. I, I basically plug myself on the 5G and do I notice a difference? Sometimes I do, but like I said, most likely you are not the problem. So remember that. But that is one thing that you could do that could help you. The other thing that you could do that people do sometimes um, when they go into like the advanced setting of the connection issue, if you look at a lot of people online, they talk about like to have quicker, uh, less lag when you play games. They go on to Google's DSN uh, IP address, uh, not IP address, but their DSN where the, the, the number is 8.8.8. .8 .8 point eight and the one underneath is eight point eight point four point four and by you putting yourself on this sometimes you'll get better internet connection when you test your internet you'll get a better upload and, and downloading connection apparently okay now I've tried this but the connection that I have myself is already good uh, for example uh, I think my downloading is like 400 something and my uploading is like 40 which is more than enough to play games because any game I play I don't lag except for FIFA the other thing that I could tell you that works is if for your example you're playing on a TV for example I play uh, since I have the PS5 I like to play on my 4k TV because that was the whole point of buying the PS5 I wanted to have better graphics so I don't want to play on my monitor because I used to play on a monitor because you have less input lag when you play on a monitor screen, okay? Which, this is true because I've experienced it myself because I do have a monitor. I just don't choose to play on it because I'd rather play on my 4K TV because, like I said, it's just a personal uh, choice. I want to play with better visual gameplay, okay? But if you're struggling with a lot of input delay, uh, a monitor screen will help that. That is guaranteed. You will notice a difference with that. The other thing uh, that could help you, uh, that a lot of people have, have, have said that helps them. I've tried it, and to be honest with you, I've never really noticed a huge difference. And that is actually plugging your remote control directly to your console, like having it wired. Uh, you know, like when you're charging it or whatever. So having it plugged in while you're playing. Uh, some people say they get less delay with that. Um, the problem that I, that, I, that I find out of that is that it has nothing to do with the gameplay lag. It has to do with input delay of your buttons, which for me, that is not the issue that I'm having right now when I'm playing the game. The biggest issue that I'm having right now is that when I'm going, for example, like from the Vision gameplay to Foot Champions gameplay, it's completely two different games. And what I mean two different games... It's like I am going to a game where it's uh, super nice while responding and the other one is completely sluggish, completely slowed. All my players are off sync. They're, 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 they're all running like if they're on ice. They're like, it feels like they're, they're, they're sliding. They're bumping into each other. They're falling. They're, some of them are not even responding. They're just standing still. This is completely um, server issues. And this is what I'm trying to explain to people when I say most likely the issue is not you it's ea okay so please um try to stay positive in a way of saying that uh when i mean positive is is positive in a way is the problem is most likely not you okay so so for people that are like going crazy guys i'm telling you most likely you're not the issue okay you could see all the people that are streaming all the people that talk about this on YouTube, about their FIFA videos, about how bad the gameplay is, a lot of us are dealing with this shit, okay? Unfortunate, there's most likely nothing that we can do until EA decides to fix their servers or change their, uh, their ways of, like, uh, matchmaking. There's another thing that's going around for the last couple of years where it's called lag compensation. I don't know if you guys ever heard of this. It's something that they use to basically even out the gameplay. Because if you're playing versus somebody that has a worse connection than you, eventually it wouldn't be a fair game in EA's eyes. So what they do is they compensate the lag so that the person that you're playing against 
would have a better um, game experience. But apparently when that's happening, the person that has the better connection is having a bad experience. So I don't know. Anyways, these are all speculation, uh, but I'm pretty sure some of them are very, very true. Uh, in the end, there's also uh, stuff inside the game itself. Like I'm a big believer in, um, you know, like in, um, in handicap and stuff like that. So there's other stuff happening in this game that sometimes um, everything feels like um, there's some game settings adjusted from game to game because it, some, sometimes, like, I, I don't know, man, like, there's shit happening where, it, 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 you know, you can't even, you can't explain it. But anyways, hopefully this video helps you. If it does, please leave a comment. Let me know if even you guys know some other strategies to help you uh, help out the people if they're struggling. But like I said, most likely, guys, you are not the problem. Okay? Have a good day, guys. Bye-bye.